Today we're going to paint this little violin. After I stared at it for hours last night, I've quite liked this white wall, so I'm going to keep it. So the first thing I'll do is spray it around it white lightly, then I'll mask it, then I'll paint this a gold color, brassy gold color, and these black. Paint the walls. Now we're just going to mask it. Took the neck off for easy masking. Now the trick to masking is two things. Patience and don't stretch the tape while you're masking. Chances are it will bleed. So just slay it down softly. Now before painting the face gold, it's a good time to slot these holes. That's where the strings were sitting to. Now why all black? Because matte black is the best base color for gold and silver. And I'm going to paint this gold. Here are the black parts. The back. The front. Gold. And here's my black thumb. Now you probably all know this might be a little bit too clean for my taste. So let's put it together and throw it in dirt. Now this way it looks like. Oh, that's my thumb anyway. And the violin. So that's the white wall, that's gold, black, 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 strings are made of fishing wire, bound there, then super glued. Let's pop him on a model and see what it looks like scale wise. Let's use him for now, he's probably one of my favourite characters. He suits all the instruments I've made so far. It's just a look about him. Maybe it's the hat, maybe the blindfold, don't know. And that looks pretty close. That's pretty good. Very happy with that. Obviously I have to make a chin piece, make his neck longer, but I'm very happy with that. What do you guys think? Are you here? Yeah. So I'll start with animating him in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this one, if you did. Please give it a like and share. Cheers guys.